supposed to be finding the father, whatever his name is, right? Father Martin. See the movie, so that's where I left the card. Okay? Frank! Joker! You. I need your help! Where are you? Yes, coming! Hey, have I been here before? That's where I just came from. Go down here anyway. Oh, it's cracked because you must have missed this part. I uh, I tried to jump to this ledge a little while ago and drop the camera like all the way to the two floors under me. So I had to go through the darkness and find it. And by the time I found it, it was cracked. It pretty much. I know I'm recording like everything, but I've got six batteries, so I feel comfortable with it. I'll, I'll put it away for a few minutes. There's Governor. There's Governor Chrissy, here he is. Boys. Just jumps in my lap, and I'll be playing a video. Okay. Alright, guys, I'm actually missing two fingers. Somebody cut them off last night. Not appreciated. Not only that, but I didn't have anything to wrap them up with, so I'm just... Uh, exit interview recorded December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Clearance Sierra Alpha. Subject, Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 14866. This 
ships are here. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all, no trickery? None. In June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. Uh, no, you know, I don't, I don't Can you think that why the D4 ML is still doing anything. Um, I really can't say for sure. I haven't talked to any of them lately. And actually, uh, the ladies have been pretty inactive for a while, but the, uh, they're coming back. They're redoing the site, and, uh, we're probably going to start recruiting, maybe... Um, I can't really say too much about it right now, but um, we are going to try to update a lot more and be a lot more active. Um, being and, you know, doing reviews and all that kind of stuff. So, just uh, keep an eye out and everybody that didn't give up on us, thank you. You have to find her again. Oh, no the gaming community. I see a fly, and they're gonna start. Run! Oh God, I don't like the sun. There's supposed to be a key down here somewhere, right? He's got to be in here. I want to open the fucking door. I want the key. I've never played League of Legends. Um, I'm pretty sure it is compatible on 
on my Mac, but based on the gameplay that I've seen, I I don't think it would be the type of game that I'm into. Uh, but I would be willing to at least try it. I just have I've just never downloaded it. Yes, I did hear about the new Mortal Kombat, and I'm extremely excited for that. Really excited. I'm not any good at fighting games. I play for fun, you know. I'm sure I could, I could at least be decent if I would play more, but yeah, I don't play very often. I, I do like to play. Sometimes I win. Now and then. back the way I came, right? Yeah, okay. I'm looking forward to, uh, to both of those games. Actually, I'm really looking forward to Dying Light and The Evil Within because if you haven't noticed, I pretty much love uh, survival horror games, so I'm really looking forward to uh, both of those. My light looks great, and I uh, I got to see gameplay for The Evil Within at PAX East this year, and it looks pretty badass too. I'll go out there then, it doesn't look like there's anywhere else to go. What is Dying Light about? Um, I don't actually know, like, the plot of the game. I just know that it's a zombie game and it's got some pretty badass killing scenes. It kind of reminds me of Dead Island a little bit in the way that it, it plays. Um, but go watch the trailer. <laughs> I like that dies on huh? yeah. Go Go watch the trailer for Dying Light. It is awesome. I mean, it looks like it's going to be a lot better than Dead Island, and I love Dead Island. Yeah, I would. I would definitely, uh, definitely stab that guy if I could. Just, I don't mean.